What's up guys? We're here, we're at Nate's house. We're uh, gonna be installing some parts on my GTI today. Here's the beautiful, here's the beautiful girl right there. So uh, today, we're throwing in some uh, 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 spark plugs and coil packs. It's time, the maintenance has to be done. The parts are here, as you can see. Uh, so yeah, we're here, and we're gonna do some stuff. So, you ready for this? Yeah, we're gonna do some let's stuff. do it. It'll be fun. Woo! Step one, open the box. That worked. So, got some parts from ECS. If you have a, any type of Volkswagen product, they are excellent. Uh, in anything Porsche, um, Volkswagen, BMW, Mini, anything German basically. So, uh, here we go. Here's what we got all our parts here some uh, spark plugs, our receipts, and a nice brand new red top. Beautiful little coil packs here. It's gonna look. This is gonna look real nice in the engine bay. Oh yeah, that's nice. Check out that. That's very nice. All right. Here we go. So, first thing we have to do is obviously open up the hood. So here we are. Pull the little latch. There we go, and there she is, yes. Nice new speed intake right there. Missing the badge right there, but we got some nice 1.8T. So here we are, this one only has this one little uh, screw right here to take off, because it was used, I got it, and uh, yeah, I don't know, previous owner did some stupid things. I think we can just actually uh, turn it with my finger here. Yes we can, look at that. So this comes off. Slap this bad boy over there. Oh, my hands are dirty. And there they are. There's the old ones. We gotta get those out of there. And this thing needs to come out so we can get to that fourth one down there. So, uh, yeah. Got a nice upgrade of diverter valve right there. Nice turbo way back there. So, uh, let's get that bad boy out of there. Alright, so we got this little guy off. So now we gotta get that little bolt right down in there. No, that's too big. Come on, Nate. Hey, this is a big bag of food. Nate got a new toolbox over here because he thinks he's cool or something. Got all the nice, uh, nice guys up in here. Some, uh, go. some pliers and things and, uh, some wrenches. He thinks he's cool or something. But yeah, it's actually a quite a nice little toolbox. Took forever to get here though, but yeah, whatever. Yeah, two weeks. Yeah. Did you get it out or no? No, would you like to do it yourself? Oh, sure. Why do you have a giant extension on this thing, dude? Because. You get a small one if you want it. No, it's okay. I need a ginormous extension. I can get you another one to add to it. Okay. You need to be like touching the roof up in here. See, this thing's enormous. I mean, if you wanted to do it, you could have just done it. Bruh, your car. <laughs> Alright, there she is. She's out. This little guy. Oh, is there another one? Yeah, there's another one on that back side right down there. Where'd you put the other one? It was right there. Over here. Oh. Alright. There we go. Take that bad boy off of there, and there's our last coil pack right there. So we got one, two, three, four. And we're gonna change them. Five, six, seven, eight. No, no, no. It's just a four cylinder. Eight. With VTEC. There she pops, popping off. Just pull her out of there. And yeah, there's our other one. Pop that bad boy right there. And repeat the process till you get all of them done. All right, and the last one. There she comes. I wish my car was this easy. And there we go, V6 probs. Yeah. All right, now they're all out. We just gotta get the spark plugs out now. All right, here we are. We got all the spark plugs out of there. All of those are empty now. Oil. Yeah, these has a little bit of oil on them, just a little bit. It's probably not a good thing, but uh, I'm gonna try and diagnose. Oh my goodness, really, dude? My bad. God, I'm gonna 
gonna diagnose that a little bit. So uh, yeah, gonna put in some nice brand new uh, NGK uh, platinum ones as you can see right here. So uh, yeah, gonna gap these bad boys and uh, put them in. All right, here we are. We got our nice little gap tool here from AutoZone, gapping them to uh, 0.32 on these nice brand new spark plugs. So uh, this one is all good. Let's get this bad boy out of here. So uh, here we go. This one's gonna go into that first one. We got three more to go in. So you ready for this? Yeah. Making race cars. All right, here's the old stuff. Nasty. And there's the new stuff. Yummy. All right, guys. Well, we we're doing our install and everything. We we're putting in our spark plugs and stuff, but somehow, don't even understand how. Brand new spark plug sockets. The little rubber grommet that's inside the socket stuck to the spark plug. So, so much for lubrication. Yeah, I don't even know how that happened. So now we are on our way to Sears to get a, a set of um, little picks, so we can hopefully get that little grommet off of that uh, spark plug. So. Yeah. yeah, I don't really know how that happened. Brand new spark plug sockets. He just got them, what, like not even that long ago, like a week or two ago? No, I had them for a while, but I never used them. Well, regardless, still, you know, like that's super weird. So like I said, we're on our way to the store. Hopefully I grab some picks so we can proceed with this uh, little install here and get my car back on the road. So yeah, see you at Sears. Did we find it? I'm gonna buy the long one. We found it, there she is. Should I buy the long one or the short one? Should probably buy the long ones. Or should I get the short? Get the short ones and not the short. Or you could get both. Because if someone has thirty dollars of stuff, one's ten, the other one's eight. Or should I get the so, big one? Can't you the, math? The, the big. I think that's a little bit too I big. Think it's gonna fit down there. Yeah. I think we'll probably have to use this guy right here. This little, little hooky thing. Uh, hopefully that'll work. Otherwise, she's gonna be stuck down there for a while. So. Uh, and you're gonna get out of a car. Yeah. That will not be good. All right, let's go. All right. Should we get a low profile jack over here. Dude. Have my oh my god. Yeah. All right. Let us go. All right. We have successfully purchased some little picks without no wallet. So that was interesting, but we got them done. So we're going to head back to the house now, try to get that little grommet off of the spark plug. So uh, yeah, let's uh, hope this goes well. Otherwise, I don't know what we're going to do. I don't know how we're going to get that bad boy out of there, but uh, yeah. Rockin' Daddy's Accord. Oh yeah. With the most uncomfortable seats in the entire universe. But yeah, all right. Get you guys back to the house, woo! All right, let's try to get this stuff off up in here. So, I don't know if you guys can see down in there, but uh, right down in by that spark plug is the little grommet. So, Gotta get it out. Now I'm All right, we one. got it out somehow. I don't, I don't even understand how that even happened, but there she is. She's too looped up. That doesn't make sense. It would have come off then. Yeah, it came off the socket, but it wouldn't go back. That's back. super weird. Whatever. All right, let's finish this up. We are running out of daylight here, so we want to get this out and back on the road for a nice little test drive. So. Let's put that coil pack, where's she at? Here she is. Put that coil pack back down on in there. Where is she? Yes! There we go. Victory! Boom, nice right in there. Connector. Ow. There we go, nice little click. Man, they look good. That little, uh, that little red accent, woo! All right, let's get the last two in. We are good. We are good. I say this is successful, right? Yeah. Successful. Yeah. A little bit of some uh, mishaps. Probably put this bad boy back on there as well. But uh, yeah, cool. Thanks for thanks for coming along, guys. As usual, there will always be uh, programming coming out every Monday. Our news little segment every Monday is coming out. So uh, always check that out. A couple of install videos like these coming along, especially as warmer weather's coming on my car, on Nate's car back there, and then our friend definitely Anthony's car. He's got a Civic SI that he's gonna start putting some parts into this summer, hopefully. So there'll be lots of content like that coming out. 
this weekend we're going to Chicago Auto Show, so we'll come out with some stuff from down there, hanging out with some friends. So you can expect some content like that. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, like it, hit subscribe button if you want to see some more uh, content coming out. So yeah, Nate, throw us some deuces. Peace. All right, see you guys later. Peace.